So guys, for today, let's talk about rafter. So here is our example. We have here, and this is the Excel file. I've already prepared this here, the table. So first, in this example, we have to use 2x2 by, by 6mm angle bar. And we have to input this. We need this length side units to get the total length. For our parts, we have top cord, bottom cord, vertical, and diagonal. So this is our top cord, bottom cord, diagonal, and the vertical. So to get the length of this, we can use dal and then point this, and this is 4.73. And for our bottom bars, I mean bottom cord, we have to DLI and then here 4.7. And for the vertical, DLI and 0.75 equals 0.75 plus the rest of the vertical. We can also do something like this. Right click. Uh, first is top. You tap this and then when it's highlighted, you right click and then properties. So the box will show up. There, Here it is, the length 0.63 plus this 0.51 i will not round up then here the 0.39 plus 0.28 you please just follow um, and this 0.2 so that's all for the vertical cord and the vertical members and then for the diagonal we have 1.18 and then next is 1.12 then this one is 1.07 and this 1.03 plus 0.72 so that's all for our diagonal member so we have now the length the side so what do you mean by the side so if this is let me show you how it's in the plan if the plan shows like this 50 by 50 by 6 mm angle bar angle bar so if it shows like this so meaning uh, this is two sides so the two um angle bars is joined together like this using it's welded like this i hope you can imagine now let me show you this i hope you can now imagine what i'm talking about uh, something like this so it is joined together for these two dots okay that's what it means so but for this example it is not two-sided so we just have to put one through every members and for the units it is how many rafter of this type is it so you can check it on the plan here it is an example it's a roofing roof framing plan and we can check it here the rafter four and here rafter four rafter four rafter four so let's count the rafter four this is rafter four four also so one two three four this is rafter five so just four four units okay so we have four units of this type of rafter. So I input the, that here, four, and then link equals, then top here, it's four. So I've already equaled or linked it so that it will automatically reflect. And then for this total length, it is already done. It is programmed, so it is just equals then units four times top the side number of sides times the total length and then equals i mean enter so you just have to drag it down here and it will follow okay and then the 
total. So for the total, it is just equals, then type sum, open parenthesis, then tap, and then drag. So then close and enter. So we have 69.24 meters. Or you can also drag up until here and then out equals. So that's it. So for the numbers of 2 by 2 by 6 mm angle bars, because the commercial length available is just 6 meters, so 6 meters, and then equals this total length divided by the 6 meters long, 11.54. But you can't buy 11.54 pieces, right? It should be a whole number. So what we are going to do is just after the equals, you have to input the round. And this time, round up. And open parenthesis and after the formula, it's comma, then zero and close. So zero, so that we can have a whole number. So 12 pieces. So for this, we can have 2 by 2 by 6 mm angle bar that is 6 meters long equals 12 pieces. So this is now the number of pieces for these materials needed to have these four units of this type of rafter. So that's it. Thank you so much. Happy Sunday!